Hi, my name is Jason and hope you are okay today. We're having a Bible study on the life of prayer. We're looking at what the Bible teaches about prayer and I hope that this will be a rich blessing to you and an encouragement to you in your walk with the Lord. So let's come before the Lord. Dear Father, we come before you today and we confess all our sin and we confess all our failure and the weakness of our hearts. We acknowledge that you are our God, that you are our Saviour and Lord and we give you the praise and the glory. And Father, we pray as we look at your word today. Father, we pray in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ that you would teach us and lead us by your Holy Spirit to know what you want us to know. In Jesus' name, Amen. Okay, if you turn to Acts chapter 22, Acts 22, Acts uh, 22, verse 21 and 29. And he said unto me, Depart, for I will send thee far hence. They gave him audience unto his word, and then lifted up their voices and said, Away with such a fellow from the earth, for it is not fit that he should live. They cried out and cast their clothes and threw dust into the air. The chief captain commanded him to be brought into the castle and bade that he should be examined by scourging that he might know whether for they cried so against him. And as they bound him with thongs, Paul said unto the centurion that stood by, Is it lawful for you to scourge a man that is a Roman and uncondemned? When the centurion heard that, he went and told the chief captain, saying, Take heed what thou doest for this man is a Roman. Then the chief captain came and said unto him, Tell me, art thou a Roman? He said, Yea. And the chief captain answered, With a great sum obtained I this freedom. And Paul said, But I was born. Then straightway they departed from him which should have examined him. And the chief captain also was afraid after he knew that he was a Roman because he had bound him. Then if you turn to Acts 28, Acts 28, Acts 28, verse 11 to 16, And after three months we departed in the ship of Alexandria, which had wintered in the isle, whose sign was Castor and Pollux. And landing uh, at Strychus, we tarried there three days, and from thence we fetched a compass and came to Regium, and after one day the south wind blew, and we came the next day to uh, Poti Potioli, where we found brethren and were delivered, desired to tarry with them seven days, and so we went towards Rome. And from thence, when the brethren heard of us, they came to meet us as far as API for, um, Forum, I think, and the three taverns, whom when Paul saw, he thanked God and took courage. <clears throat> 